Loco. <laughs> she looks she's so, so cute. Happy. She's so happy. She's not boring or anything. No. She's not right. She's on my lap. She's yeah. lovely. right now Which is pretty good. Lounge. <gasps> pet lounge! Is that the pet lounge? Yep, that's where we go. Bella's been tantruming literally the whole of our journey. <laughs> <laughs> she is not. <laughs> not Glad a happy she bunny. went to the toy there. I know, honestly. All right, we're gonna get out now and meet Alinda and the girls. Don't leave the whole thing. Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> Hello! Hello! For anything in particular, oh, oh, I'm trying to think of. usually take a thousand of them. So, did you know that's not a, that's a camel one? I, I love one. that one. Oh, it stinks. I love it. I'm not thoughts. <laughs> 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 smell? I hate that one. Okay. They should bring back the blue one. one, it's more like coconut. <laughs> oh, is it? I want to get the pink one. Oh, it's like fruit. That 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 smells so good. good. What's that one? Tropical. What's that? Uh, this one here. Ooh. Well, like so many perfumes smell the same. What's this one? Have you sprayed this one yet? What one? So. That's Jimmy Choo Blossom. Yeah, this is the exact. That's yeah, what I wanted Jimmy Choo when I was pregnant. Oh, really? Mm -hmm. That's beautiful. Oh, yeah, that's nice. That one's a special edition. Oh, that's, that's not bad. Bombastic side eye. Oh, yeah. Smell? Ooh, that's what that smells like. It's not bad, is it? Very sweet. I like it. 47. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Was that? Give me two the other one. I'm not that yet. I'm smelling. Are you gonna get it? Because the other one. Oh, it's a nice place. Shawn Mendes way. Tickets on our second day, and this next song, I'm gonna try for them. Oh, yeah. I'm just sitting on my money. Oh, oh, no. That one's really good. I don't like it. Do you like it? I don't like it. How about that one? Where's your hand? I'll do that. That was alright. Yeah. Le Angel. You're back again. You're back again. It's so beautiful. It's peaceful, isn't it? Such a good girl on the ferry, yes you were. 
is all cozy now. I've got a seatbelt on. I'm gonna read a little bit because I'm almost finished my book actually. Not much to go. Not moving yet at all though, so I've got a little bit. <laughs> Um, Ozzy Osbourne. Oh my god, that was actually crazy. Um, have my morning cup of tea in there. <laughs> oh, look at that one. <laughs> oh god. Snacks. So I remember I recognise how those. Okay. I don't know what the hell those are. I don't know what the hell those are. All those. Those are like strawberry. Well, these are just like fizzy pencils, aren't they? Just yeah, like pretty French much. brand. This is just like sour Harry Bows kind of. Mm -hmm. Kit Kat balls. Yeah, I've never seen these in my life. <laughs> oh, that. Do we have them? I don't know if we have them. We used to have them. Oh, did we? I remember these ones. Yeah, I don't I remember, remember the fizzy. These are quite good. Oh, yeah. What's on the inside? Marshmallow. Oh, yeah. I just pushed one. <laughs> oh. Oh, is this like a toffee lolly? Oh, I don't know. Chocolate frame. I think it's like a chocolate lolly. Oh, okay, it looks so good. Oh, that marshmallow is. That's like a Reese's. But no, this isn't even, that isn't even edible. Is that is that a shell? Oh, oh. Oh. Is that something you can like, eat out of? Oh. Len Len Lumand. I don't know. That's is that really weird? Scummy or is that a shell? I think it's something that you can like, eat out of. It's not really good that's, though. That's like larger versions of... Where's it? Where are they? Them. Hmm. Mm, I'll tell you what though, the pick and mix in Disney. Oh, they actually so good. Oh. So good. Love these kind of bracelets. I love I need these. Mm. Yeah, these are quite fun. I bet you the ones in Paris are better. Though. Yeah, they yeah. They're so much better. You're better off waiting long. until exactly. they're actually in main Paris. So you're going to be going in shops and that. Yeah. That's, that's pretty. Yeah, that's quite cool. Oh, it's really curved. Shake that, shake that. Shake that. Right. This is actually Abby wild. and I have this, right. So these are like fuzzy felt drawing things. So the lines are felt and we colour within them. But I've not seen these I in I remember years. mixing the actual thingy together. Actually. Yes. Oh my God. That's crazy. And they had like Disney ones yeah. at the boot fairs and stuff. I remember having Rapunzel ones. Yeah. Mm. Oh, these were actually my favourites. I used to love these. How does he know this? Yeah, literally. Same. I completely forgot. That's just unlocked a hidden memory. Yeah. <laughs> spot we're just trying to kind of map it out where we are our Linda and the girls are a little bit further down literally like this road and we're currently down this little street willow is loving life at the moment just trying to figure it out because there's a lot of like little apartment buildings um yeah so the plan for today is we don't have a Disney pass today. That's for tomorrow and the day after. So this is our one. This is so cute. I love that this one has the flowers on it as well. It looks really pretty. As I was saying, basically we don't have a pass into the Disney parks today. Um, that is for tomorrow and the day after. So we're gonna kind of chill around this area, settle ourselves into the Airbnb. Also, there's like quite a lot of restaurants and shops. So just have a little nosy. Sorry, just have a little mooch about, see what's there. Um, we've left all of our stuff in the car still because we're a little bit early. Don't think we can check in just yet. Is this ours then? Definitely. Yeah. Okay, nice. Thank you. Thank you. Very creepy <laughs> it's very dark. Ooh. Top floor. Oh, it's very windy. Oh, oh, that makes you feel a bit sick. Come on then. Here we go. Oh, little window. Oh my god. Oh, I'm very afraid. 
wheeling the cases up here. That's and we've got such heavy cases as well. There's no door numbers though. I think it's... None of them. No. They've got to be on this floor. Oh, look how cute this little view is. Um, not to have. <laughs> no. Really. Oh, nice. yeah. Are you guessing that? That's the right key for that. Oh, it's there. Are you sure that means it's it? Oh, it is. Oh, thank gosh. Oh. Oh, it says Elcom. <laughs> oh, oh, this is nice. Oh my God, how cute. Okay, time for a little room tour. Okay, so here is the front door. It's kind of like a little studio apartment. So as you walk in, you've kind of got this wall here and it kind of somewhat separates the living room from the kitchen. So this is the kitchen, really nice. Got a little counter, bath stools. Oh, I actually love the tile. I haven't, I haven't actually seen this yet. Um, but yes, I really like the design of everything. It's very modern. This is the window. I think this is so cute. I absolutely love this. Like, it's very like authentically French, I feel. Um, massive doors. And it looks out actually to the little restaurant complex, which is down there, which we were just at. Have some shelves here with some decor, which is cute. Willow's kind of exploring the place, making it her own. We have this little welcome sign, but it's an Elkham sign. <laughs> Assuming they lost the W. Um, but um, is this a... Is this shoes? Oh, it's, um, yeah, just storage. Again, all open plans. There's a sofa that pulls out into another bed, coffee table, TV. And then this is the only bedroom that we have. And it's got, oh, cute little desk. Love this chair, actually. Again, has a view on to like the complex and the marina. I think that's what this area is called, but look how cute this is. It's a very, very quaint little town. It's got a full length mirror and we have the bed, which actually has Marilyn Monroe on it. Yeah, it's very cute. This wardrobe, let's have a look. Oh, we got a hoover, got hangers, bedding. Well, not that we're gonna be using the bedding, but good to have it anyway. It's quite cute. Let me show you actually. Oh, also there's these cute little photos, which I like. Here is the bathroom. We really loved the bathroom when we were looking at it. Mira, I think this tap, has this got LEDs? I'm pretty sure it did on Idiot. the thing. I don't know. Sink, obviously, toilet, walk-in shower. And that is the whole little studio area. So my dad's gone down to the car to get one of our suitcases. We have two and they're heavy and there's no lift. So it's gonna be a bit of a nightmare carrying it up the stairs. It's all right, it's fine. And then I think we're gonna go to a restaurant somewhere in the area. Don't know where yet though. <laughs> Mum and dad have gone down to the car to get the rest of the luggage. So it's my job now to put this in the bedroom. guys let's talk because i haven't spoken too much in this vlog yet so let's have a little chat come here oh, my baby. okay so as you can see we are here now hold on there we go <laughs> as you can see now we are at our airbnb um we are just settling in now um our lind and the girls have also settled in in theirs they're just unpacking <laughs> what are you doing this is a different place to where we usually stay in my past disneyland vlogs um you would have seen the locations that we stayed at and they were pretty much within the exact same area i think it was chessy i think we stayed last time and this time last summer and that is our absolute favorite place whenever we come to the parks we always always aim to stay there but obviously because we're bringing willow this time which we never usually bring willow we had to find an airbnb which is dog friendly so that is why we chose this also it was very cheap I think it was like 70 pounds a night, something like that, which is very good as well. But overall, so far, I think the Airbnb is good. Is it the cleanest? It's not the worst. It is definitely like clean. Obviously the building is very, very old. <laughs> as you would have seen from the entrance, it is a very old building. I think they've done a great job to like modernize it and transform it. It does have an old like musky smell. Um, obviously but i guess that is expected because it is such an old building we just kind of got around and cleaned some stuff overall i'm i'm quite happy with this airbnb you know we're not going to be spending a lot of time in here this is literally for us to sleep <laughs> all four days that we're here we're literally going to be out we're going to be in disneyland for two days and then and obviously paris for the whole day after so we're really not like 
fast. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? Would we stay here again? I think, I think we would. If we were to bring Willow again, Willow! If we were to bring Willow on holiday with us again, I think we could potentially stay here again. Obviously it depends on the area. We've not explored the area yet, but so far first impressions, it seems really nice. Yeah, overall, I think it's fine. You know, it's a place to sleep. And also you get what you pay for. Like this was 70 pound a night. You're not gonna be expecting luxury, but I think overall, I think it's a, it's a cute little place, you know, not too shabby. But yeah, I wonder what um, our Lynn's and the girls' place is like. Hopefully theirs is nice as well. I think Willow's enjoyed the trip so far. <laughs> she's, she's a bit confused. She's a bit disorientated. She doesn't really know what's going on right now. The outside though looks gorgeous and it is so hot. When we were traveling up here, it was quite cloudy. It was warm, but it wasn't like, you, you, wouldn't like, you wouldn't consider it hot, but it is hot now. It is like 26, I think was the last time we checked. Yeah, let me just show you the outside. I think I already have, but I'll show you again. This is the outside view. I absolutely love these shutters, but as you can tell by these shutters, this is an old ass building. But yeah, as you can see, you have the little restaurants down here. We've got like three restaurants below us. And then you have a little bridge, obviously, and we've got some shops and some restaurants down there. Let me show you over here. I think you'll be able to see. I'm gonna be a bit quieter just because there are people outside eating, but there's an eating area there. And I think um, our Lynn's place is just like in that alleyway over there. You okay, Willow? <laughs> She's a bit disoriented. She, she doesn't know what to do right now, bless her. But yeah, honestly, we are all so excited for Disney. I actually cannot wait because the others obviously haven't been to Disney for like five years, I think they said. Like, I can't wait for them to see the updates that they wouldn't have seen yet. It's gonna be great. I cannot wait to see their reactions and go on all the rides. It's just gonna be so much fun. I can't wait to vlog it. Oh, baby, it's okay, it's okay. <laughs> it's okay. I think I mentioned in the beginning of the video, um, I'm going to do a travel video of how we brought Willow abroad with us. If some of you, you know, want to bring your pets along, it may be interesting to know. So I'm going to do that when we get back from Disney. So the location of this um, Airbnb is actually closer to Paris than it is Disney, when usually we're closer to Disney than we are Paris. Okay, I'll keep you updated. <laughs> found a place to eat it's at go gorilla which is literally under our airbnb we are all starving yep <laughs> we are all hungry <laughs> we just need food finally chin chin cheers five years in the making this literally um, how this has literally been declined, oh, like, cancelled like five times. <laughs> there we go. It's finally happening though. Look what you got, Ali. Fish and chips. Looks so good. <laughs> Lynn, that looks amazing. You both got a chicken burger? Yeah. Oh my god. Looks so good. Yeah, Mike. Mike, what do you get, Abby? I got crispy chicken mm -hmm. and mac and cheese. Oh, it looks so good. I think Mum got a meze platter, something like that, and I think Dad got the same as well. We're all starving. Oh, we did accidentally trap a wasp. When we, I say me. <laughs> I'll help you. <laughs> yeah, you help me. It had to be done. I'm sorry. <laughs> Mercy. Mercy. Mum. What? Mmm. I can this already so taste good. the garlic in this. Yeah. It's good dog. Yeah. Finished our meal. It was lovely. Did you guys enjoy it? Yes. It was. Did you enjoy the dinner? Oh, I loved it. It was very nice. So it was lovely. So we're currently going back to my Airbnb. <laughs> I also need to feed Willow. So we're going back up to Airbnb, and then we're going to go to the supermarket and try and get some essentials for the room because we're probably going to be hungry later. No. Literally. Um, oh, no, no, no. Just chuck it in for five plus minutes to open the door. Hold on, hold on, hold on. <laughs>
Was it easy for your parents to do this? So, I can feel it open. Right, pull, pull. <laughs> I'm gonna break up the doorknob. This is so funny to watch. Oh, right, pull. Let's ride. Dun, 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 dun. <laughs> I don't even know what that was. I'm, I'm delirious <laughs> now. From the, I, I did just know. make it up. Mum, it's named after Abby, Lanky's Pizza. <laughs> Lanky. <laughs> <laughs> I need a more fat pizza. <laughs> oh my god. So we are heading to the supermarket to get some little essentials for the room because not gonna lie, we do need some bits and bobs. She's got a little fish skin flatty. <laughs> She's loving life. Eating this on my bed by the way, this is all my bed. It's pretty comp oh anything she does is just so cute. I was gonna vlog more at dinner, but to be honest, we were all like, it got to a point where we were all like hangry. So <laughs> we just we just needed food in us. Um, but that was really nice. We stayed there for a couple of hours um, and then we went to the supermarket. Again, I was gonna vlog in there, but it was a really small, tight little shop and there were lots of people in there and some people just didn't seem like they would be in the mood to be caught on camera. So I didn't vlog in there, but we did get some essentials. We got some snacks. We've not got too much because we're gonna be eating out pretty much the whole time. I've just showered. I feel so clean. I felt so grubby today. Literally, where the heat was just melting my makeup off. It felt cakey. I was so happy to get makeup off. We have grown up some in the background. Absolutely love that film. But yeah, Al, Lind and the girls are in their Airbnb. We went and visited their Airbnb and there's a so cozy like and mind you like we've actually grown to really love ours i really like it i love how big the space is what are there some things that could be improved yeah but to be honest we're literally resting our heads here that's all that we're doing we're not staying here or anything like not spending our days in here and i'm already for bed i removed my fake tan and i put on a fresh coat a fake tan because I don't want to be cakey. The last thing, like one of my fears is actually looking patchy <laughs> with tan. Um, so I took it all off and I put a new coat on. So now it's just developing. Yeah, so we have a busy day tomorrow as it's our first day in the park. We're all so excited, cannot wait. It's gonna be so good. I am just buzzing for it and everyone else is as well. We do have to get there a lot earlier than usual. Um, usually we get there about nine, 10 o'clock, but because we have Willow. Disneyland actually have an animal daycare center. I'll talk about it a little bit more in the next vlog, but you can actually put your dogs there for the day, um, which is amazing. Because a part of us feels guilty that Willow's gonna be in the animal center alone, it's actually a blessing disguise because tomorrow's literally meant to be like 28, 29, 30 degrees. If I'm being honest, if we were in main Paris tomorrow, it wouldn't be fair on Willow to be walking around in that heat, especially with her coat. She would become unwell and it's not fair. So it's actually really great that we're going to Disney tomorrow for her sake, so she's gonna be in a nice air-conditioned animal centre, so it has worked in our favour. But yeah, so that opens at 8am, and because they don't have a booking system, uh, because they're not that busy, you've just got a first-come, first-served basis, so we've got to get there early, because if we don't get a spot for her, then we're kind of screwed. <laughs> that opens at 8, so we're gonna meet the guys at 7.30, and then we're gonna head over to the park, get there for 8, so it's at the beginning of the day, and then the park doesn't open until 9, so we're gonna look around Disney 
Disney Village and show the guys at like, the hotels and that because they haven't, haven't actually seen the hotels, so that'll be fun. Yeah, I just thought I'd update you. It's been quite chill today. Honestly, the journey did not feel long. Like driving genuinely didn't feel long. Flew by. Yeah, it was really easy. The area that we are staying in is so, so lovely. Let me show you outside the window. Honestly, it's such a nice ambience. The outside, I don't wanna get too close to the window because people can see it because we have the lights on. But look how just cozy this is. Obviously you have, that's the restaurant we ate at. Really nice like vibes. As you can see, it is a beautiful little sunset. My bed all made up, so we're good to go. It is gonna be a hot one tonight, I can't lie. The view from the bedroom is lovely as well. The Marne, I think that's what it's called, the Marne, I'm not sure. Definitely love the area. And this is my fit for bed. <laughs> Debatable if it's cute or not, but these are my Disney PJs. I wear these every single Disney trip. It's just nice light and area. I got these from Primark. I have a little dumper in the pocket, but yeah. <laughs> That's my sleep fit. I'm wearing my hair in a bun, so it is kind of like curly for tomorrow, so I don't have to get up twice as early to curl my hair. Obviously, I am going to get up early, but I don't, don't want to get up, you know, extra early just to curl my hair. So if I sleep in a bun, it's going to naturally be a little bit curly tomorrow, so that'll help me out. I have my outfit laid out for tomorrow as well. I've got my Disney X Coach Terry, which I'm so excited to take. I have my mini ears and I have my dress. I'm not going to lie, I was debating whether to wear my dress tomorrow because I was like, it's literally going to be boiling. But to be honest, that's no different to me wearing like shorts and a t-shirt so it's fine it's a short dress it's thin but like it's a thin material so it's not heavy or anything i think it'd be cute so yeah that is the update for this vlog and i guess that's pretty much the end of this vlog as tomorrow will be a whole new vlog in disneyland paris oh i can't wait it's literally our third time in disneyland paris in 12 months how crazy is that? It is actually my fault, we just absolutely love Disney. Um, so yeah, I'm very excited. So that's the end of this vlog. Thank you guys so much for watching if you did watch up to this point. I hope you guys enjoyed today's little travel vlog and please, please, please make sure you subscribe because obviously we're gonna be in the parks the next two days and we're going to Paris City Centre the third day. So you definitely don't wanna miss those vlogs. Okay, that is all from me. I'm gonna go to bed so I have all the energy in the world tomorrow. <laughs> I'll see you guys in my next vlog when we're at Disney. Bye. Thank you.